Thank you for calling the Employment Development Department. This is how hairstylist Veronica Rodriguez spends her days trying to reach someone at the EDD, only to get hung up on. Please try your call again later. I called 26 times yesterday. Today I am at, I believe, 21, and it is 10.30 in the morning. The out-of-work hairstylist and mother of two says her unemployment payment stopped coming weeks ago with little explanation. With her savings drained, she says she's thought about violating the health order to keep her family fed. We're put in a position where I don't want to work illegally, but I have to make an income. The Center for Workers' Rights says their phones have been ringing nonstop. They say the EDD froze payments to hundreds of thousands of people after issues of fraud surfaced. Then Congress delayed reauthorizing pandemic assistance programs, forcing them to first cancel and now extend the program. There continue to be issues in the implementation of these benefit programs that have severe consequences for the claimants trying to access them. The owner of this Berkeley hair salon says none of her 18 employees have received payments from the EDD for weeks. Three of them have had the issue with the fraudulent activity and others just can't certify until January 24th. So all of them have no pay right now. So I'm incredibly worried about them. I'm upset, I'm angry. Hairstylist Roxanne Guralia had to send in a photo ID to verify her identity. Yet she still hasn't gotten paid. She's pleading for the state to help. Do something. You have your people, there's people out here that don't know. We're in limbo. We don't know what to do. The Center for Workers' Rights urges exactly people not to flood the EDD with phone calls. They say payments should resume soon. We reached out to the EDD, but they did not respond. In the East Bay, Jody Hernandez, NBC Bay Area News.